right on today's video i'm going to show you my 300 blackout 7.5 inch barreled pistol build and the reason i'm showing you this is because this gun is now complete i got it exactly how i want it but i don't have an optic system on it yet and i picked up a new optic system for it and that's what's going to be in the next couple videos we're going to be doing an unboxing on that optic and mounting it on this and then taking it to the range and testing it so let's go over everything that i have done to this 300 blackout pistol the upper this upper is made by davidson defense i bought it as a complete upper and i got it from delta team tactical it's got the timber creek charging handle it's got the strike industries link foregrip on it On this side, I went with the Olight, and this is the Balder RL, laser light combo, red laser. These have the switch on the side, so this is laser only. There's your laser and light together. Just the light. This does have the quick detach mount on it, and I did add a section of rail to this side of the upper. As far as the bolt carrier group goes, this is what was sent with it from Davidson Defense. Same with the forward assist. Let's get into the lower. So this lower is just an Anderson stripped lower that I bought. From Rural King. The grip on this, I went with the Fab Defense grip. The trigger guard on this is Timber Creek. Same with the pins. These are Timber Creek pins. quite a few strike industries parts on this i did go with the ambi safety and i do have this set up for just the 45 degree i am left-handed so i made this gun completely left hand friendly and speaking of left hand i got the strike industries ambi mag release on it so when i'm need to change a mag i can just Tap that and drop the mag. Back here, I have the Strike Industries Enhanced Castle Nut, an extended end plate. The brace on this is a Shockwaves Technology blade. It is adjustable. Pull that down, take it off. And at your furthest point, and there it is, all the way in. And my favorite part of this lower the trigger. This is the Rise Armament Rave trigger, it's just a drop in trigger system. And the very last thing on here is the bolt catch, and this is Timber Creek. I got it all put back together. I don't want to go over this trigger with you. It is empty. No mag. So this trigger is nice. That's all there is to it. Here's your reset. That's it. Super trigger. And I believe I bought this on a sale at Palmetto State, and I got it for about 99 bucks. That's all there is on the reset. There's your brake. Got the wheeler trigger pull gauge out. Let's do a couple trigger pulls on this. Right at three pounds.
Do one more. Dead on, three pounds. All right, there we have it. That's my AR pistol build, 300 blackout. It's gonna be the first of a few videos. The next video will be an unboxing video of the optics that are going on this. Then we'll get it out to the range and test it out. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.